Hello guys, in this video I'm gonna teach you how to create your own light ray brushes. So let's start. Okay guys, so I'm gonna start from here. So first I'm gonna unlock the background. Double click on it, press OK. And then go to the bucket tool and with the black color, color everything black and then lock it and add a new layer. I'm gonna name it Ray. Okay, so click on Ray and go to the Marque tool from here, hold on it and get the circular Marque. And from the middle, just hold Alt and Shift and drag to create a proportional circle with about 2200 width and height. And after that, go to Select, Modify, Feather and put it at 200 pixels, press OK. And after that, go to Filter, Render, Clouds. And you will have this nice looking effect, so click anywhere with a Marque tool, you will deselect. And then go to Filter, Blur, Radial Blur and then put the amount at 100, the blur method at zoom, and the quality, you can put it whatever you want. I'm gonna put it at good. And the blur center, which is this, you can put it depending on the picture you're putting the light on. So I'm gonna put it at this side because I want the light to come from this side. So press okay. And you will have this nice looking light. So to make it pop more, you can go to image, then adjustments, levels, and maybe put this one at 25 and here about 0 0.0 or 0.65 and here about 200 so press ok and now it pops more you can always go to filter sharpen unsharp mask and put the amount at whatever you want if you want very strong light you can put it maybe a very strong amount but i'm gonna just put it at about maybe two and the radius about 180, press OK. And after that, just go to the adjustment layers from here and put at invert, and then go back to the layers and you will have this invert layer. So just go to select and press all. You will select all of the invert here and go to edit and copy merged, and then go to edit again and paste. And you have a layer of the inverted image. And after that, just go to Edit, and then Define Brush Preset, and name the brush whatever you want. I'm gonna name it Ray, maybe two, and press OK. So after we're done, we can now place the light on the image we want. So I have an image here. So I'm gonna find the brush I just created from Window, Brushes, and just go down until you find the brush you created. I'm going to put the size about 1200 and make sure you put it at white foreground and click once here and you'll have this nice looking raise. 